Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to set up your own quarry. However, before I do this, I'm just going to show you my setup, which is something you most likely will just aim for or as just an example, how to actually set it up properly. So what I've got here is just I've got a quarry. Now there is obviously an output system, so everything is going to the chest. And then if I basically because I had too much cobblestone, what I've done is I've just put an auto workbench that just transfers all cobblestone into compressed cobblestone and that's going into the chest. So something to be aware of if you have set up a quarry, you need to remember that you will have a lot of cobblestone and most likely dirt. So make sure that you also think about this. Also have plenty of storage because if you don't, your chests will be, they will fill up very, very quickly. Okay. Now, a quarry obviously needs energy. So what I've done is I've set up three main engines and two backups just to make it faster. And I'm using combustion engines. So whatever you're using, you need to obviously figure out what it needs. Combustion engines need fuel and water. So what I've just done is I will put a little pump with an infinite uh, water source and it's just getting directly pumped. Now, if you need basically to pump anything, just use redstone engines for like pipes and stuff. Just use this as it is cost efficient and it doesn't run on anything, right? The redstone engines are very, they're not powerful, but they're powerful when it comes to little tasks like pumping the pump or pumping the, the, the pipes, right? Coming from the chest. This is also very very useful right okay so now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna show you how to set up your own quarry okay so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna explain how to run your own quarry okay so what you need to do is you need to craft a quarry first obviously the way to craft a quarry is you just need to come to your i hope you don't have this mod because it's very very helpful if you just open up and what you need is three iron gears two gold gears two diamond gears a diamond pickaxe and one redstone right you just need to place it. Now, the thing is when you place it, as you can see, it builds a small default, basically sort of its own mining area. But this is very, very small. Unless this is what you want, then that's fine. However, if you want to build your own basically bigger area, you need something called Landmark from Buildcraft, right? So if you just place it, for example, let's just place it here, here, and obviously it needs to be aligned. So what you need to do, actually, if you right click it, what it's gonna do is gonna show you if it's aligned and it's gonna build a line. So let me just walk here. Let me just place it here. There we go, and that's it basically, right? I also like to place the fourth one, but I'm pretty sure you don't have to. Right, there you go, right? And now what you just need to do is you need to just place the quarry at the marker, and there you go, right? That's it, as you can see, the area has expired, okay. So now what you just need to do is you need to get some kind of power. So I'm just going to connect this creative engine, which is only available obviously in creative mode for just this demonstration purposes only. But before I connect, I'm actually going to get, I'm going to place a chest and I'm going to connect some pipes. So what we need is just some gold pipes. There you go. So I recommend using the gold pipes because they're the fastest and just connect to the chest. Now, obviously, if you want to sort items and stuff, you're free to do so, but I'm not going to do this. Now, however, if your engines are too slow, what you can do is you can obviously build a lot of them. So what I've done here is I've placed eight, sorry, 10 engines. And what you need to do is you need to put a wooden kinesis pipe, which is just an input power pipe. And then you just need to put a golden kinesis pipe, which is usually the best because it has the highest um, output of power or allows the, uh, the highest basically flow of power right and as you can see it's going pretty fast and what is going is it's just going into this diamond chest right so very very simple process and simple setup but it, it, it works right um, as i said i don't recommend using the quarry because it's sort of outdated and this mod i'm pretty sure is like 15 years old and it's not compatible with other resources like mechanism mechanism is compatible with industrial craft 2 that's why i also use industrial craft 2 Right, one of the best mods in the world. Okay, hopefully. right, so that'll be it for this video. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, comment if you enjoyed, and if you'd like to see some tutorials, make sure to leave a comment down below. Peace.